Hi everyone, I'm Steve Conish, and this is an OpenShift 4 authentication and logging quick walkthrough. Let's get started. Okay, let's log into the cluster. We're using the default project. You can type OC, who am I, to see how I'm logged in. Okay, I'm cubeadmin. Okay, let's go ahead and check the status on the OpenShift authentication namespace pods. So we're going to run the OC get pod dash n shift authentication. Okay, we have two pods running. We can go ahead and dump the logs for each one of those. Okay, we can see some TLS logging, which is what we hope to see. And then we can go ahead and repeat that command and use the other pod name as a input argument. Okay, there's not too much going on. <clears throat> So the next thing we're going to do is increase the log level. So we're going to do OC edit and then we're going to go ahead and edit the operator to increase the debug log level. So we're going to go down to the spec line just below that and add one level or one line rather to set it to debug. Go ahead and save that. We're going to go ahead and log in to the web console just to drive another uh, connection into the cluster. And then we'll go ahead and do a um, get pod, uh, review the pod name, and then go ahead and run the log command one more, one more time. OK, that's running. And let's go ahead and run the log command again. And we're going to run it for this new pod of this name here. OK, and we see some different logs there, which is kind of interesting. OK, so we now have um, the ability to get the logs and increase the log level. And let's assume that you're all done with that. The last thing we're going to want to do is restore the operator to the original log level. So let's go ahead and delete that line that we added. And that's it. Now we're back to normal. And that concludes this demo. Thanks for watching.